My father's name is Frank. He collects vinyl since he was 13 years old. Today, he has more than 700 vinyl records. I remember when I was younger, he was listening to his records in the dark and said that it allows to be more in tune with the sound. This passion has always fascinated me and I decided to learn more about why people love vinyl. Alfie is from Bray and he collects vinyl since his childhood. His collection has about 1,000 records. For him, the vinyl is a real treasure. The artwork on the vinyl, the vinyl some vinyls were 500 copies made, some less, and they never repeat that. On, on CD, it's, it's, it's just mass reproduction. And the quality isn't there, the sound quality isn't there. You've got a piece of vinyl, it's like, you take it out, you see what track you want, you clean it. I remember last year I listened to Led Zeppelin's first album <clears throat> for the first time on CD and I couldn't believe how weak it was compared to the vinyl. The vinyl was... but the CD is... Yeah. <laughs> Indeed, all the vinyl lovers agree that the sound quality makes vinyl exceptional, but it's not the only reason. It's nice to have something to hold, uh, something to look at and read the lyrics. Uh, and the inserts and all, to have something of value as well that will actually go up in value. According to Alfie, there is much more than the sound and the materiality. There is something more psychological. A lot of people come in when I have the shop. They're coming in the suit and the briefcase. They, they look like the most unlikely people who are going to ask for something psychedelic or something, you know, from the Rolling Stones. But even though they look like a businessman, when they were younger, like me, um, either they had that record, or when they heard that record, that's when they met their girlfriend, or that's when that happened. So it captures a psychological moment or memory. If each vinyl is a memory, Deep Purple in rock is a childhood memory for my father. He bought it when he was 13 in Wales then sold it some years later. This is a sale that he regretted. But I managed to find it. I think it would be a very nice Christmas present. I think again, then it goes back to having something that's special, having something that, you know, 10, other, 10 million other people don't have. It's not a throwaway product, it's something unique. I, I just feel vinyl will, maybe the quality can't get, it can just get a little bit better, but it will always stay in the format, hopefully, that it is in as a piece of vinyl. I think maybe the, the, the uh, recording um, and the production will, can get better, but how better it can get, it's fantastic as it is.